What is up everyone and welcome to the Free Star T-Shirt Showcase, also known as the preliminary rounds in determining our Free Star Champion. So everyone who bought a Free Star T-Shirt got to go in this event and uh, we kind of sold more than we expected. So we're going to have to do, I don't know, about eight, eight man battle royales just to narrow it down and then we'll bring up the tournament bracket and then they'll be mixed in with real superstars such as Kenny Omega and uh, we'll see the crowning of our first free star champion and out first it is Cal Stevens to get us going for our eight man battle royale fancy entrance called the pyros kicking off he's out next and here from Johnny McRoberts is Drew Carter now his signature names are as follows. The Snapmare Corkscrew Roundhouse is the Shock Factor and Dr. Teeth is called Just a Checkup. Finisher names. So the Full Nelson Slam 2 is known as the Stormont Slam and the Running Enziguri is the Titanic Kick. As Drew Carter joins Carl Stevens. That's two out. Six more to go in this opening match. Next from Space Dow Gaming is Chrome. In ring signatures are the Tornado Bomb called the Avalanche Barbarian Bomb and Avalanche RKO, which is known as the Avalanche Raid. In ring and out of ring finishes are the Batista Bomb called the Barbarian Bomb and Samoan Drop called the Scandinavian Drop. This is Chrome, the Barbarian. You've then got Matt Roberts. This is from RT underscore Roberts. His finisher is the MJR, which is a half Nelson netbreaker. And then you've got a coaster coach, which he calls from London with love. The gimmick is a show off, charismatic, and he believes he is the best as Crom exits the ring. And with a one pant situation. Yeah, always catching me off guard the whole uh, one pant situation. <laughs> so that's Matt Roberts. Back once again from Max Power. It is war. And he says he is a beast bent on destruction. He returns to Freestar to destroy anyone who stands opposite from him and become champion. He took Perkins' advice from his last match and keeps the chains wrapped around his arms whilst he wrestles. His signatures are the Devil's Grasp and the Cranium Crusher. His finishers are the Dead Man Driver and the Head Splitter. Anyone unfortunate enough to stand across the ring from him will soon be on the disabled list. War is hell. Good God, look at that image. It was cool. When it came up from the ground. War and Crom in the same ring in this eight-man battle royale. Clash of the Titans there already. God, the rope almost <laughs> came out. broke the rope. That'd have been it. Game over. So we've got, as I said, roughly about seven or eight battle royales. And the winners will then go into the tournament, remember. And that's when we'll have the bracket officially announced. We've still got people coming in with their calls. We're still not sure on the final number just yet. That's why we don't have the bracket at the moment. Up next from Jeremiah Golder is Devon Storms. Oh boy. Nice jacket. Nice pants. Whoa. Nice shades. Is that glow in that jacket? That's glow in that jacket. Illuminous. And Devon Storms, in his description to us, told us this. He is the self-proclaimed rock star. Star. And there you go. Returning to Freestar. He's so impressive. He's a rock star star. <laughs> <laughs> Up next, we have got James Liger. And this is from, excuse my pronunciation of this, Chidimma Abamu. So he says, my core is James Liger. It's just me as a wrestler. <laughs> Fair enough. The second attire is a prototype of a character that I'm planning on portraying at the London Lucha League called Imudu, an African warrior demigod that I came up with. <laughs> the purple armband is in memory of Great Kun, a Humboldt penguin from a Japanese zoo that fell in love with an anime cardboard cutout. What the? <laughs> These have some backstory, these characters, I tell you. I that. honestly didn't expect that going the way it went. I don't know what I just read out. Next, we've got from Daniel J. Lazek. 
The character is essentially a highly technical and cocky guy whose gear style comes from his love of 80s horror films and culture. His shotgun stunner finisher is called the Lasex Surgery. His second finisher is the roll through Boston Crab called the Bone Machine. He tends to work the body during a match, including use of the signatures, which is a butterfly lung blower, which is called the Come From Romania, and his diving top rope knee drop, known as Death From Above 1987. He's small but prefers to fight old school rather than fly a lot. He's not a full heel, but he's an above a well timed groin kick or rake of the eyes. <laughs> Okay, Devin Storms for me. I am Carl Stevens and I'm taking on war. I'm just swinging away. I'm trying to take out Crummy. Eh? Try and take out the two big guys. They're all oh, spinning back fist. Uh, it's just taking me. everything. He's just punching me, Mr. One Pant. I believe. I don't actually I'm well confused with all the names. There's too Matt many Roberts. to learn. That's, That's Matt, Matt Roberts. Roberts. I go in the middle. Oh god, Carl There's Stevens. Too much happening in this don't match. you dare crumb. Don't you dare crumb. Don't you dare crumb. Back off, Crom! Back off, Crom! No, Crom! No, Crom! No! Got it! Got it! Got it! Got it! No, God! Ooh! Can't steal this from out of nowhere. <laughs> yeah. Like you're working on war. I want some. <laughs> oh my Crumb God! Liger fainted. Look at Liger taking war out. That was yeah, that not the happen. best of attempts. Oh. He's going for it again, though. He isn't deterred. Oh, I'm up. I'm up. Uh, I don't know who to go for. War's just taken out James Liger. Oh, Jay. Let's go for Jay. Oh. I'm going for Jay. You can't go for Jay too. He's just pushed him off. And then I've just stomped him in a corner. Oh, I'll go Drew then. No more crumbs there again. God, he's having you on. Oh, he's got out of this one. He's got out of this. Oh, no. Oh, yeah, he's made it. these punches to crumb. Off the ropes. Yes. Taken out. Well, I'm not doing so great here. Carl Stevens with a nice move there. Need to remember not to run at people and do moves, especially if you're close to the ropes. Is that Jay on the bottom rope there? Uh, yes. And then you're going to have to Drew. No, <laughs> I was. And then he changed his mind. Drew, Drew, Drew. Got you. Nice save. Oh, oh my god! No, no my god! Oh, he survived it. He survived it. How oh, dare you, Carl Stevens survive war? Oh my god! Can war survive, Cat? Is he in the corner? He's kind of looking at the camera. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what happened then. That was weird. Sorry, I wasn't paying attention like it was. Oh my days! How's he got the strength? Might be the biggest version of that. I've got my signature at the rock bottom! Oh war! I'm flying! <laughs> Cast Evans finisher! Not to me! Oh god! Oh Crom! What's happening there? Be thankful you're in the safest part. I know. On the free star. In a battle Matt royale, Roberts. you want to be on the free star. Any other match, you don't. <gasps> oh, oh, oh! Who's just gone? I think it's Drew. It's Drew. Drew's left us. Drew. I think it will by Jay. Was it Jay? Where's Jay? Where's Jay? There we go. Oh, oh Wall's gone, gone for him. gone for him. <laughs> Wall must have liked Drew. <laughs> oh, oh he's got the watch. chains right in his chest. Is this going to be We're so easy for We're all just watching war? this. Can Jay hang on? He's got a signature waiting if he can get out of this. Wag has been a genius right here in that under those ropes. He's got out! It. He's got out! Oh god, wall's not going down. He's gone! Oh. <laughs> Why are you hitting me, you doofus? <laughs> Liger! Oh no, I'm going! He's gone! Wall's taking us! Oh god, Liger. I'm sorry, Devin Storms. Oh my god. Going for war! Has again. Crom been there all match with Matt Roberts? <laughs> I think he kind of has, you know. <laughs> oh my words. You're still in it with Carl Stevens. I've gone with Devon Storms. Shall I go and help Crom? We also lost Drew, unfortunately. We've also lost Jay. I don't think I can do Oh, there we go. There we go. He <laughs> must have been now. Oh, he's turned around! That? It was me! <gasps> War's gone! Liger's like, just eliminated War! Oh no, oh, Crom! God, Crom. You get rid of war and then Crom's there. The barbarian. Oh god. I'm going to take Crom out. Have you got a finish? No. Oh he's Jesus. Well, he's oh done a Jesus. Good job there. <laughs> oh god, what was that garbage? Just to attempt a headbutt at the end as well. Yep. Matt Roberts is. I'm not going to do Matt because I'm going to charge him. I thought that'll just go. Why are you all ganging up on me? <laughs> the threatened by your uh, macho frame. Yeah, that's what it is. <laughs> I mean, squeeze it. I actually really do like the trunk design, to be honest. Matt Roberts! 
He's holding come on, on. Come on. He's going to escape. Oh, he's got out. Liger, the man who eliminated War, can he do the same to Crumb, the monster slayer? I nearly ran him. him. I panicked then. Oh, God, not again. Oh, God, what's he going for? Just some elbow strikes. Oh, he's not finished there. Oh. Do another reversal then. Can Liger do it? Can he get rid of War and Crumb? What an accolade that would be for him. That would be crazy. Oh, Matt's on a finisher now. I think Crumb's still my favourite, though. Just look at his health in this one. Oh, God. I ran in between it's the two. Be difficult to oh, God. Oh, my words. Alabama slam to Crumb. Matt Roberts, good positioning. Crumb, good yes. positioning. Just annoying Liger and Cal Stevens. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Don't you mess around with me, Liger. <gasps> oh! What, what just happened? Matter? He's just fallen out of the ring. <laughs> Oh, backbreaker! Is it going to come down to Liger and Crom or can Cal Stevens, the underdog, pull off another upset in this one? To Crom! Oh, oh we got connected. a connected, but I have myself in focused on Cal Stevens at the minute. Matt Roberts, unfortunately, just get wiped out with one Indeed. Irish win. He must have suffered heavily during this match to be in a position like that. That was unexpected. <sighs> um. Crom, you don't want to. Oh there my days! You might be He's safe. on again. Oh god, what's? The... He's oh, going he's for it. For... He's going for it. He's got a signature, so he can't eliminate. He's running at him. Oh, oh no, he reverses. Liger and Crom going at it. Cal Stevens, there somehow. <laughs> Try and work out who to go for. <laughs> oh my god! Why is it an elephant trunk in him? Yeah, yeah, it's really cool. Oh, I really like the design. I think that's the barbarian bomb. Cold breaker. Oh god, I went for an Irish whip. Is he too big for Irish whips? <laughs> oh my god. Oh my Wait, god. go out as easy. <gasps> wow! He's gone! Wow, Crumb's gone! And then there was two! on James Liger! The monster slayers! <laughs> one got rid of War, the other got rid of Crumb. Oh my word. Perhaps they do deserve to be the final two in this one. He's got top. Oh god, he's getting up. Ooh, you're alright, you're alright. Get, get, get up, get up, get up, get up. Unless get up, he's got a catch That's finish. That's what I'm thinking. Go, oh, it connected. He didn't have the catch. You've got the finisher, oh but god. he's got a finish he's as well. Got, this one is horribly, horribly wrong. One he's in the corner, he's in the corner. Is he going to be our first? I'm sorry, James! I'm sorry! First winner. Ooh, I'm sorry! <laughs> He got oh, down to the final two, but Cal Steve, how has he won that? I don't know, he's probably the smallest <laughs> guy in the match. He was about the size of Ward's leg. Look at that! The ground shook at freestyle when that happened. Oh, I'm in war, the power behind him. Look at him just watching from behind. Cal Stevens goes into the freestyle tournament to the next round. What a huge victory for he a small guy. Look at him on outside! That is a shock. How have you pulled that off? I'm not actually sure. I'm not actually sure. Right time, right place. Let's move into our next battle royale. Second battle royale then. And another place up for grabs in the Freestar Championship Tournament. And up first from Thomas Watson is Matthew Sindiek from American Samoa. He wrestled all around the world. His gimmick is a Samoan party animal. His finisher is called the Pacific Bomb. His submission finisher is Game Over. Cool. So he'll be looking to get through this to hit that submission finisher in the next round where it actually gets into one on one triple threat potentially competition. Yeah. That submission won't really do the job here though in a battle royale. It might wear someone down. But uh, the Pacific Bomb could definitely. So this is Matthew Sindiek. Next up from Robert is Dynamite Lee. He's a fun-loving guy, but knows when to get down to business. Give him a wrestling ring and a crowd looking to be entertained, and he'll show you what he can do. His finisher move is a buzzsaw kick, which he calls the dynamite kick. If that's somehow not enough, he's got the moon stomp to fall back on and wipe out the competition. I can picture that already, the moon stomp. Dynamite Lee. Blake Anderson next, from Edison Maya. The superstar's name is Blake Anderson and was born in Grenoble, France. He's 26 years old. As a child, he grew up with a family that never appreciated him and in his adolescence ran away with a criminal gang to the United States to have an exciting life. 
A few years later, Blake left the gang, deciding that he wanted to get his life back on track. He remembered watching matches of Bret Hart and Stone Cold as a child and pretending to hit stunners and submissions on his stuffed animals, so he decided to pursue wrestling as his career. He's wrestled across several promotions in the United States and in places such as Russia, Ireland and South America. Everywhere he goes, he wants to be an example of how one can turn their life around for the better. What an in-depth backstory. From Chib, my nib. It is Chubble. He's a professional <laughs> MMA fighter who wants to decimate the freestyle competition. Oh god. He has a secret on beating his opponents. It is a lot of built-up anger from his parents naming him Chubble, which he releases in the ring. Wow. What a backstory that is. What a bunch of back hair that is. Being called Chubble. <laughs> He's so simple. One name as well, like Cher. Chubble. What a mad backstory he's got. He is one to watch in this battle royale. It is Ray Brown from Mr. V. And he is a neck breaker, stunner, slash cutter enthusiast. His gimmick is like an Aussie hitman focusing on headshots. His finisher is the Hunter's Mark. Oh dear. Someone who means business. Don Braddock from Zero Striker. The power of the North, armoured superiority, the human tank known as Don Braddock, weighing in at 322 pounds, this former Leeds United hooligan turned WWE superstar, uses his brute strength and power to dominate his pitiful opponents, with a strong brawling style using all areas of his body. His finishers are the B-Bomb and the Damned. Be aware of the oh my god moves. Don Braddock. Looks like he means business. So second to last in this eight-man battle royale, Cesar from Carl Smoove. He is a super heavyweight, weighing in at 370 pounds, and he is seven foot tall. That's all we need to know about him. He sends a message, just the uh, imposing size alone does that. Lastly, we have got from Spooky Cyrus, Pierre Michel. Wow. <laughs> He's <trying to> handle. <laughs> He's a former French male stripper turned pro wrestler. Good God. His finisher is a diving body splash from the top rope called Fornicure. And uh, that's all we need to know about Pierre Michel. I've just noticed the tie. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. There's some characters in Freestar. The pants as well, what's with the frilly bit? I've just noticed. That's the best bit. That is mad. Okay. Blake, no. Don't you dare, Don. I am trouble. Yeah, I've got as Blake Anderson and Don's already about to eliminate. Don't you dare, don't you dare, don't you dare, don't oh you dare. Oh my god. Blake Anderson, hang on. What's Pierre Pierre Don's Don? taking what's Pierre Pierre doing? doing? What is that? <laughs> to the back of Cesar. Trouble that one. Jesus. Oh, Lee. He wasn't ready for the one. Nope, everyone's still there. Ray Brown working on Sidiek. Pierre what are celebrate. you doing, Pierre? <laughs> I want Pierre to win this one. I should have gone as Pierre. I'm going to do the job though with Blake Anderson here. Look at that for a rocket kick. Oh no, 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 don't you dare trouble. Don't you dare. Oh my god. You don't need help. <laughs> everyone's helping him. Stay away from him. Stay away. Stay away. Yes. Oh. On. How's he's he got out of that? Oh god, he might not have done yet. His French charm. He always kicked you both away. Oh my days. Don't go in after. Blake Anderson here repeatedly. I blame Cesar. I need to get the second reversal. I got it as well! Uh, Pierre, excuse me. Oh, Matthew Sindiek is in trouble. Dynamite Lee's trying to push him out. Here we go, yeah. Raised down in the corner. Oh, Matthew, let's work on Matthew. Oh, actually, Dynamite Lee. I don't know which one to go for here. I'm just going to start punching and kicking on whoever That's it what I'm doing, there's such a rabble of people. Just <laughs> swing away. <laughs> oh! The dog absolutely broken. <laughs> oh no! Oh! What the hell? Where'd that come from? from Ray Brown. Oh, he just moved out of the way at the right time. Matthew Sindiak now on Blake Anderson. Ray Brown top rope, putting on a show here for the free star crowd. Come on. Don might be going. Surely Don can't go. No, 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 no. Where's Hang on. Don, Don Braddock. Hang on, Blake. He's there. Boom. Yes, there we go. He's still, we have yet to have the first elimination. Come on, there's too much happening, there's too many people. <laughs> that is a lot of strength. 
That's going to be too far, surely. Yes, Anderson gets away from that from Ray Brown. Signature. Oh my days. One more for a signature. Ray Brown! Oh, Ray Brown hangs on. Pierre, I like your tactic. Cesar! Ray Brown after. A little feud with Ray Brown. Cesar! Oh, What's this? Watch this move. Oh, he didn't do it. He just went for a kick last time. He kicked him right in ribs. Oh. Oh. Dynamite Lee! Oh, Clinging on for dear life. Yeah, he's been there for the last five minutes. <laughs> yeah, I'm not surprised. Finisher on Don Braddock. Chubble's hiding under the ropes now. Pierre. <gasps> no, Cesar. Oh, he's going to reverse Cesar. Oh, oh my dears, what an uppercut. Oh, God. Where are you going with this? I'm not sure yet. Is Pierre going to set Don It's perfect Braddock? for you. Oh mm, god! Yeah, it didn't connect. Where am I? Oh, on the ropes! I got lo oh, lost track of myself. Dynamite Lee, I think, was invisible for a second. Still no one gone. Don Braddock is in a bad state at the minute, but he might just eliminate Blake Anderson here. I'm going to have to start tapping his ball. Oh no, I found the reversal instead! Big on his arm! Pierre gets taken out. Dynamite oh god, look where Pierre out. is! Oh, what's Ray Brown going to do here? He's going to go straight for the elimination. Oh, God. Confidence that I'm going to Oh, go dear. Cesar. Pierre's just reversed my signature. I have gone for yet. If we can get rid of the big man early, that'll help everyone out. So, oh, I've gone for Dynamite. Okay, I've gone for him instead. Pierre's taunting. I might have just screwed this over oh, for Dynamite God. Lee. Don does not like Pierre. Dynamite Lee might be the first to go with it. Oh, he is. Oh, no. <laughs> Cesar. I said I was going to work on says I accidentally caught dynamite. Cheap button and you taking him out. <laughs> Just sweep it under the rug. Pretend you had nothing to do with it. Cesar. Oh, I didn't reach. I'm going to make it up to dynamite Lee by taking Cesar out. Oh, that is nice. On I'll help you out. I'll help you out. Matthew I'll put him in the ropes. You run at him. Okay. Go on. You. Oh, oh, oh you can still get him. You can still get him for that position. <gasps> Goodbye, Cesar. That's for dynamite Lee. Although you took dynamite Lee out. No, I say that is. Mm. What? <laughs> How has Cesar gone? And uh, Dynamite Lee and Pierre is still in this. Oh my word! <laughs> oh. Like you can hear the commentary. Matthew's not going to enjoy that, is he? Behind him? Oh, he's left him. He's going after me. Oh God, Don, Don! I'm going to have to use my signature again on Pierre. Boom! That's him out for the next 10 minutes. He loves getting that move. Oh, God. I kicked you down. Blake Anderson's fine. Ray Brown's gone. No. Don threw him out. See, Don's the next big guy now. Uh, I think you're forgetting about the trouble. <laughs> nice drop kick by Pierre. I don't think it's called the trouble, but I don't know. Trouble later. Seems like it should make sense. Trouble Thorus. Trouble. <laughs> That's his nickname. <gasps> Pierre! Oh god, almost. He just, he just walked it off like not what happened. Oh! I finished then. You're almost gone. You're about to super kick me then! This is a finish. Don! 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 No, don't you do this, Don! Have you seen yet? He's oh, gone! Oh, he's not gone! <gasps> Pierre! He's fighting back! Oh, oh. Christ. Oh, I thought I might be a close Don't be now. taunting! He's got two finishes here, Matthew Cindy. <gasps> Pierre! He's going to oh. take Don out! <laughs> he's going to try. He's pushing him, he's pushing him! Oh, Should I go and help him? Anderson. I might go and help him. I've punched him in the back. You have not helped Pierre I've there. I've punched him in you the back. turned on Pierre, Chubble. I've, oh no, I mean it! My back. Oh god! Oh <laughs> no! How's he done that? That's a situation where that occurred. <laughs> He doesn't know what to do. He's absolutely fluked to that one. He has just taken out Trouble and Don in one Did move. you see Don pleading? <laughs> oh dear, Don's not happy with that now. With a finish. <gasps> Pierre's just slipped behind him. Oh. Trouble is down for the count right now. Don Braddock, dark red body. Ooh. Uh -oh. Oh, that didn't happen with a shoulder thrust. Oh, he's reversed he's it. Reversed it. He's, on... <laughs> he's, reversed he's got it. a signature and three finishes, Pierre. Put on, Pierre. The ring's yours. Oh my god. Everyone thought you were a joke. He's proven otherwise. <gasps> he needs to change to a finish. Yup, he's gonna back it up, he's gonna run at him and he's gonna reverse it. <laughs> Pierre, what's he gonna do? What's he gonna do? <gasps> I 
I saw oh, it out! He don't want to act! He don't want to get blood on his hands! I'll do it for you! He's using this thing. He's using this thing. Go on! What have you got against Chubble? Eh? Don Braddock, dark red body. Can Blake Anderson eliminate him here? He's gonna get the run up. Blake Anderson! He's gone! Don Pierre! Oh, Pierre turns! Blake Anderson let Pierre do all the work on Chubble. He's got another signature! He, <laughs> he wants Wait. me to do it again! He don't want to get blood on his hands! <laughs> God damn it! Do I have to do everything for you, Pierre? Some weird little tag team forming with Pierre. Oh god! See, look! What the hell's that? I don't know. He's sort of selling a move. Oh. Whoa, 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 on, whoa, Pierre. Pierre! Don't you dare, Pierre. Don't you dare, Pierre. <laughs> Don't you dare, Pierre. Goodbye, Don. This is his finisher. That's quite impressive, the Leeds United hooligan. <laughs> God damn it. What's he ever going to do the move? <laughs> Don't be kicking me now. You've just done a finisher to me. I'm wearing pants, that's what going to do. Oh, no, he's <gasps> taking me to the ropes. Didn't even have time. Oh, <laughs> oh, my God. Pierre and Blake. Oh, my God. That was quick. It was. <laughs> It all happened just in a flash, blink of an eye. Oh my god. Oh! oh. Kicked no. out! <laughs> Two! Chubble's not happy looking. Gone, Chubble! It's over! He's gonna hang around as long you as he one can. one of the best backstories we've ever seen. That was fortunately, this Pierre Michel <laughs> just got the better of you. Absolutely rocking him. <laughs> Literally. Has he got it? Oh God! Pierre's lost his finish for some reason. Did you yeah, reverse one? it? Yeah, he had one. You must have reversed it. <gasps> oh, oh my I'm gonna God. drag him. Is Pierre gonna do it? He's grabbed you by the neck. He's gonna drag you to the ropes. <laughs> Is he gonna go for the run up? He's gonna go for it. He's oh, got no. it. Pierre's got it. Oh my God! The most unlikely of victor. <laughs> what has happened? Oh my God! How has he outlasted everyone? That was a genius spot, that. I don't know how he managed it. We've got Carl Stevens and Pierre Michel. What's he doing? <laughs> He's got it by no one! He takes an invisible punch! That's when he rocks Jubble. And somehow he has won. Oh my word, he may meet Kenny Omega in one round. <laughs> That's mad. That's mad. Ridiculous. Oh my god, have you seen him all on the outside just on one knee, like bowing down to Pierre Mission? Third battle royale then. Who is going to go forward in this tournament with Carl Stevens and Pierre Michel? Up first in this one, we have got Jesse Cole, and this is just simply from Jesse at my Van Has Candy. And he wanted to let us know that Jesse is a guitar playing gimmick. And he's available to record songs about how he hates whatever town freestyle is in. The gimmick is based off himself being a professional musician in real life. And there you go. The uh, neon the strap is pretty epic. I don't know what's going on there. This is who you've chosen to play as? It is, yeah. yeah. Oh, Jesus. This is Vegeta, I believe. Mm. And this is from JD underscore the gamer. And uh, his finisher is Power of the Saiyan. 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 And his second finisher is Final Flash. Yep. And his signatures don't have a name. He takes pride in being the greatest Saiyan yep. alive and believes that no one is better. This guy is from Dragon Ball Z, I believe. He's from Dragon Ball Z, yeah. We've put him Super Saiyan Blue as well, just to give him the ultimate power. I have no idea what this show is, to be <laughs> honest. I'm not 100% impressed with the uh, ripping off a character and putting it in, but literally. Well, he doesn't have a goatee in the show. Doesn't he? No. So, a bit, weird a bit of a weird wrestler. He's taking his time, isn't he? Normally, he wants to get right into the action, Vegeta. What's Jesse thinking. Could have played a song whilst he's coming down here. He should have done. Just talking about him. So this is Vegeta to join Jesse Cole. Six more to go. Up next, from Mr. Grump, we have got Big Devo. Big Devo. Big Devo. Uh, okay. 
and he's a hired gun slash bodyguard. That's all we know about him. I feel like he's channeling some uh, Big Daddy V. Yep. Yeah. The looks. I get that. I get that. How polished is that bald head? I know it's it's too much. A little Mohican running down the middle. A couple of like sideburns almost, just covering his ears oh, yeah, as well. Yeah. Big Devo joins Vegeta and Jesse Cole. Next up from James Roy, we have got J Roy, aka Nightmare. And he's got an aggressive, strong style who draws inspiration from horror movies, a great heel, however. He leans more towards the anti-heel role. Nightmare, despite his look, plays well with others. In a past league, he used to be the leader of a faction called the Fallen, as marked on his pants. The handprint seared into Nightmare's chest is a mystery. No one knows the origin of it. That could be a story, along with him maybe leading to a female manager. Already planning out his blooming role then. <laughs> one of his signatures is called Counting Sheep. You've got a jumping knee strike called Lucid Knees. A play on lucid dreams and his finishes is a dragon sleeper which he calls last gasp nightmare's main finisher straight jacket ddt is called the seventh day a play on the movie the ring so there we go nightmare returning to freestar then kevin iron is back and uh, same backstory as before so i'll just remind you he started wrestling at the age of 13 in ireland where he was a third generation superstar where he and his brothers learned Irish strong style. After losing his brother, he became a no-nonsense type wrestler. He doesn't care about religion or people's opinions, going by the motto of zero fear. And Ronnie tells us that Kevin is the same, although he is deadlier than ever. And now has the rip cord knee strike, which is known as death to thee. And also a running enziguri from the corner, which is known as the rapture. There we go. Here we have then Tyler Bolton from the Gohan Skullwalker. His nickname is the Mercenary, and he's a man who plays by the rules until the rules get in the way. <laughs> that's <laughs> like a, that's like off. a B movie tagline. <laughs> Explosion in the background yeah. of the green screen. Shade shotgun off. in his hand. <laughs> Tyler Bolton then. Now this is mysterious. This is from. Keegan Malentz, and this is Evan Suzuki. That's all we know about That's him. That's all we know That's about him. That's all we know about him. Is this some like Yakuza or something with a back dragon on his jersey? It's uh, very mysterious at the moment. The crowd don't know what to think of him. He doesn't know what to think of the crowd. He's asking himself, where the hell is he? He somehow ended up at Freestar. <laughs> No idea, like, what he looks like underneath to gauge anything about him. I'll have to find out when the match starts, so... Final one in this battle royale. So finally we have got... Mike England, and this is from Mike Man W. Bay. He's got no shoes. You what? He's got no shoes. He's got no shoes? Carry He's on. got no shoes. Carry on. <laughs> He's a technical wrestler with an MMA background, oh, that might explain it, with an oh, MMA background yeah. focusing on strong elbows and knees. His signatures are the full Windsor knot and the knee trembler. And his finishes are the jumping knee strike and the jumping code breaker. Cool. Well, there you go, Mike England. Ultimate weakness though, just stand on his foot. <laughs> yep, yep. We have got a monster in this one, have we? We have like in the other two. That's a change. Let's get the third eight-man battle route underway and see who progresses into that tournament bracket then for the Freestyle Championship. Okay, Kevin Iron for me. Hey, hey. Um, Jesse Cole. Yeah, I'm not appreciating this little sneak attack you've got at the start. You Combination. the fact that I'm still wearing my coat because I'm chilly. <laughs> Running at you. I stopped. I, stopped. I pressed R2 when it said press R2 and it just carried on. Right. I'm just going to get up here. I would do the oh. same thing. <laughs> Tag team. <laughs> Mike England! Oh god! Big knee Oh god, are you asking me? Tyler Bolton. Is it your time to go straight oh, away? Oh god! Oh, I don't think so. Nightmare's got me. Vegeta in the corner. Big Devo. Wow, Vegeta's health is already down. Wow. Is he going? Ooh. 
Oh, he's on the ropes! Doesn't board well for him. Oh, Tyler hangs on. Oh, God. Oh, where are you going? Right there! <laughs> Suzuki's got Kevin Irons, drags him back. Big Dave on Vegeta. Oh, but Vegeta catches Tyler Ball, and this time, Nightmare in the corner. Suzuki with a knee drop. Oh, knee strike. Oh, no. Nightingale little hanging on there. Tyler back on him. Kevin Irons fights back there. I'm going to get a run oh, up yeah. again. Off the ropes, boom! That's oh the no! Now. My King Gun just took everybody down! <laughs> All three of us over there! <gasps> and then he got taken down himself. <laughs> Nightmare. Oh. Nightmare's not oh. messing around here. <laughs> God! Frankensteiner! Just getting a read of all these maps. Is Mike England gone? Oh, Suzuki with the jabs! Oh. Big Devo. Oh! Mike England's gone! Big Devo's gone! We just had a clear out! Mike England and Big Devo! Big Devo can't continue his feud with Vegeta! Who got rid of uh, Mike England? Ah, uh, I forgot now! He was a wild card in this one to win it. Big Devo didn't deserve to win it with that hair. Rude. He might love that hair. Makes him <laughs> unique and original. We're just kicking each other in this corner. Oh, Nightmare crazy. and Vegeta going at it. Red versus blue. Oh my god. <gasps> oh, oh, reverse of my nightmare. Oh dear. Tyler Bolton. He's coming around. Tyler Will. Sidewalk slam. There's too much happening. Oh, that ain't a bad position for me to take there. Oh, nice sidekick. It's gonna fly. Vegeta's gone! Vegeta Vegeta's gone. gone! Oh crap, I'm out. I'm out. I'm in a dangerous position here. Oh no! What's this? Suzuki is gonna get rocked on to oh. Evan Suzuki. Please, <laughs> please do it. <laughs> Not the best Evan, of this. Oh, I'm in a dangerous position here. Oh, what's that? It's not a hug, did you know? Oh, Nightmare looking for the elimination on Kevin Iron. Off the ropes. What the heck? Why does he always bounce when I said it up perfectly? What do you mean? Oh, I see. Irish yeah. whip. I even go early just to make sure, and it still happens. Come on. Who are you pointing to? Who are you asking? Where are you coming? It? What's Nightmare doing? You can't decide which one he wants to take on here. I can't. I want Evan. Pele kick! We'll go for Tyler. Oh! Double I double almost fell out of the ring! Kick. Nightmare, not. Oh, Nightmare, nice. what are you doing, you, you made the ropes there by Suzuki. Oh, I feel. Tapping the buttons. No, no, oh. no, no, no. Ooh. It's gonna survive. Nightmare's gotta finish. He just needs one of you on the ropes here in the corner. He'll take Suzuki or Jesse. Oh, but he's going to get Who else has got... Evan Suzuki has got a finish, but he's got a signature block in it. Jess has got a finish as well. You've got one. God! Nightmare! Oh, it reverses! Oh, Suzuki's coming at you! Oh, no, 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 no! Oh, my days! No, don't think about it, Nightmare. Don't even think about it. Whoa, whoa, whoa! whoa what just are you looking at me for? He oh, went for it! Blocked my went for it. He just blocked my signature. Oh, and Suzuki out. Suzuki's going. Suzuki's got two finishes. I'd be very careful. He's, he's just hit a signature on me as well. Oh, oh he's, he's gone. gone. He's gone. He's gone. He's gone. <laughs> he couldn't hold on. The two finishes are wasted. Look at everyone here. Who are we going for? Look at Suzuki looking at him. Tyler's going up. We're for Tyler. Ooh, to the back. We're tagging Tyler now. Did you hear that rogue boo then? What's that about? One nightmare. We've done enough resting. Go on! No! Barely oh, no. Up here. Tyler's reverse me. Oh, that's nice. Top rope. Boom! It's gonna to get up. Nightmare, Kevin Nine, Tyler Bolton and Jesse Cole still in this one! Cross body, but he catches the neck awkwardly. Oh my god, he's reversed me. Oh, he can you help me? I was <laughs> I was I'll hold him, him. I was saying up for the knee. <laughs> what 
Look how I'm paused in the ring. Is Nyla going to take him? <gasps> oh! It's just coming and stole it! Oh my goodness. Nightmare is gone from Tyler Bolton. Tyler Bolton! Oh! Cruel! Cruel! He's gone too! He's down to a two for the first time, I think. Oh, oh no! <laughs> no, 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 no! Look at the confidence back, from pull Kevin Pull it back, pull it back, pull it back! Oh! <laughs> survived it, survived it! Off the ropes! Oh! oh kicking him out! Not again. again, again! I want to finish, I want to finish to end you, Jesse. Oh We're going to do this properly. Well, it kind of gave me my finish there. Can't what stop. the hell just happened? <laughs> Discombobulated. <laughs> mm, this is risky. Come on, damn it, damn it, damn this it. This is risky. Ah! This is very risky. There's only going to be one. Oh! 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 <laughs> I'm still holding on. Oh my god! How hey, you've just rolled straight back in as well. What the heck? What just Jesse happened? Cole's still fighting. Ah! No! Oh! God damn it! Just no, 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 no! Oh, that breaker! How the hell did I hold on then? It's a few moments ago, he didn't connect properly with it before. Can he connect properly with it this time? Oh, it's missed completely! My turn to fly! Jesse Cole with a double foot stomp! This is mad, which way is this gonna go? Oh, too fast, too fast! <laughs> oh! Nasty. Red body damage for Kevin Iron. Jesse Cole's got a signature now. There we go. All the people we've lost in this match it has come down to Kevin Iron and Jesse Cole. And he's gonna keep rolling through it. Jesse probably should have gone by now. How did he hang on? I have no idea. I have no idea. Ooh. Here we go. It's over. Ooh. Oh! Oh, it was a finish! That was a finish! Oh, and Kevin strike. Iron has just got his finish now! How has Jesse not got their job done here? He's on. No! Oh, a super kick. oh my goodness! <laughs> Taking Jesse Cole out! How did he overcome that finish at the end? I bust him open as well with it in the end. Some mad characters in that match. Oh, that, that was a was shot. A good <laughs> I thought Nightmare had been the final two there. He gets taken out. Or it by Tyler Bolton, he gets taken out with a powerbomb. Uh, I think it was, yeah. It might have been. And we have Vegeta, Big Devo as well. Oh, God. Going forward and progressing into the tournament is Kevin Iron. Fourth Battle Royale, then. Who is going to join? Kevin Iron, Carl Stevens, and Pierre Michel. Up first, in fact, the two calls we're going to see are both from the same person. That is from Dylan Buster. And this, I believe, is Ace Bruiser. He's an indie darling, current member of the Bullet Club, and he's very egotistical. He's a great technical wrestler, but he can give a bruising too. Finishes are the reverse choke sandwich, which is known as the Bruiser Bomb, an electric chair driver called the Final Dagger. This is Ace Bruiser from Dylan a Buster. Looks like he has a glass eye as well, which is kind of weird. Kind of creepy. The indie darling. So let's see another of Dylan Buster's creations then. Next up, as I say from Dylan Buster again, this is Cyborg. Yes, a Cyborg. He's Cyborg. a Cyborg built in Las Vegas. He was sent to WWE to make a mark and to hurt people. He is a very brutal wrestler and isn't afraid of anything. He has got the ripcord knee strike as a finisher and the tiger bomb is called Bombs Away. <laughs> a cyborg. So Cyborg joins Ace Bruiser. Both of these from Dylan Buster. So next up from Choppity Whoop is Connor Cunningham. Formerly one half of the Belfast based rubber tag team, the Cunningham Collaboration. Connor was left standing in the shadow of his tag partner and sibling. 
Kevin. When he won the Extreme Belfast Wrestling Championship, no longer looking to play second fiddle to Kevin, he struck him with the newly acquired title, giving him a head injury so severe he would have to vacate said title to recover from the injury. Now considered one of the biggest heels on the indie scene, and following his departure from EBW, one of the hottest free agents in professional wrestling, Connor has come to freestar to not only compete for the championship, but also possibly recruit for his new stable. Connor Never. Cunningham. I believe the new stable might be Club Carnage. Mm. Yeah, Jack, give us a clue. His mask pretty cool. I'm impressed with that. I don't know if that's a pre-built in design. Oh, it's got Deadshot vibes. Yeah, it's very cool. Next up, we have got Aaron Wolf, and this is from Patrick. And he's got two different attires. One is the face, and one is for a heel. Which one have we gone for? I'm guessing this is the face. Baby Blue. And that's all we know about. Cool. It can play two parts, both parts. And it's Aaron Wolf. Is he a big dude, yeah? He's a big dude. Is he a super heavyweight? Uh, I believe so. So, perfect for a battle royale, this. Next up, from Swift Glaze, is Ted Alpha. His power bomb is called Alpha's Throne, and his spear is called Wolf Bite. He once had a big feud with Kenny Omega, and main evented Wrestling Kingdom, and it was Alpha versus Omega. And Kenny Omega is in this tournament. He is, there's a chance he might meet. It'll be Alpha Omega Part 2 going for that Freestar Wrestling Championship. The uh, real superstars are coming into it following the Battle Royale rounds. So no doubt Alpha will want to be a part of that. He never told us he won it between himself and Kenny Omega. Ooh. Could it be revenge or to stamp a claim once again? Next up from Jake Capasso is the core known as Jason Woodward. He's a tag team partner of Jake Blade. And he was a call from my wife's village, actually. He's the muscle of the team and does all the hard-hitting moves. He calls himself the real American Dragon and has struggled to find work on the independent scene after he believes that Daniel Bryan stole his name. He believes he should be the one that should be signed to WWE and should be a former WWE champion. His finishes are the Dragon Tamer, which is a sit-out last ride powerbomb, and the Dragon Slayer, which is a powerbomb lung blower. So the way to uh, get back to Daniel Bryan is to steal some of his gear, I see. Yep. He believes he should have had Daniel Bryan's spot. He was the original American Dragon. Here then we have Dumaya, and this is from Dakota Dumaya. Finish names. The fireman's carry side slam is called Fire and Ice, and the discus knee is called the Tornado. <laughs> He's been trying for years to get to WWE, finally finding himself an opportunity through Freestar. He's a cruiserweight that will go to any height to pick up the victory. He typically wrestles clean, but will cheat if he has to for a big opportunity. Finally then, in Battle Royale number four, we have got Anarchy from Stephen Campbell. Don't have much information here. His gimmick, guess what? He's an anarchist. Wow. And uh, his identity is unknown. He simply goes by anarchy. His finisher, number one, is Spinal Tap. And his finish, number two, is called the Glasgow Curse. Right, so you can probably narrow it down to Scotland yeah, so then. You can, you can focus it. We just need to triangulate its position. <laughs> So this is Anarchy, which is going to close out Battle Royale number four. Carl Stevens, Pierre Michel, Kevin Iron, already going forward in the tournament for the Freestar Championship. We've already lost some big names. Who is going to fall in this one and who is going to pick up that huge victory? Let's get into it. Okay, Demaya for me. I am Anarchy. Look at his foot. <laughs> oh, nice. Woodward there working on Connor, Ted Alpha working on Ace Bruiser. Wolf is in trouble though. He is already in trouble. Cyborg going at him. Oh! What the hell did I happened? just get taken out? It's lucky because you should have been out of the ring. Do my Ace Bruiser's nearly gone. Woodward's nearly gone. No, no, Woodward's fine. Ace Bruiser's in a lot of trouble here. He is. Oh, hangs on. Oh, he's still got him though. He's still got him. He's not over yet. Oh, my. Oh. oh. Hey. Well, we've. Oh! No help Connor coming in there. Gliding gloriously. What the, hell, what the hell is happening? Oh my word. Oh no, Woodward! 
Connor Cunningham's just got Woodward out. That was a moment of sheer, what the hell? Big boo! Jesus! Oh, Woodward can't believe it. I don't know what just happened. I'm still shocked over the weird rope bounce thing. <laughs> oh, God. Connor slapped him then. Whoa. Oh, oh, oh. Ace Bruiser. Stop it's bouncing off the ropes, it's weird! I've just slid under him there. That's a shame we got to see Woodward leave so early. I thought he was destined to face Ted Alpha in this one and Cyborg, the other big guys in this one. No. Too it's concerned with Daniel Bryan, that's why, for Woodward. Wasn't focused on the free star gold. It's this type of match as well, you never know what's going to happen. I'm sorry. Oh no, I'll have a signature, you're lucky! And now he might be doing my own face is the wrath! Chilling out in the bottom corner, just waiting patiently. What? Wolf! Wolf's got an issue here. Ace Bruiser just left a Maya for Wolf there. I kicked him, but he totally didn't sell it. Connor's in trouble. Connor's in a lot of trouble. He might be gone next. What do you want, Ted? <laughs> Ted's gone straight for Cyborg. I'm gonna fly. I'm gonna fly. <gasps> oh! God, him again. Oh, who are getting up? Oh, trouble in paradise from Connor. Brutal. I'm gonna get some payback on Wolf here. I'll go for Connor then. Oh no, he's reversed me! Oh crikey. Yes, Bruiser is in a very good position there. Combination now on Wolf. Payback for Demaya. Oops, Cyborg. Indirectly saved my life. <laughs> oh god, what's happening here? I don't know, I've got a finisher though, and he wasn't paying attention to Alpha. Is he gone? No. Oh right, I thought you'd done it on the ropes. Sneak he's yeah. knocked out though. Wolf coming straight back for Doomire. Oh, Ace Bruiser's coming. Ace Bruiser, no! Connor Cunningham, Connor Cunningham. He's not gone just yet. He's managed to hold on oh. to it. What is this with Doomire and Aaron Wolf? I don't know, they hate each other apparently. Oh. Look at the kicks. Wolf catches or takes Doomire down. Works on the leg. What's happening here? Cyborg off the ropes to be met by Ted Alpha. Doomire oh rolls. God. Sneaking out. Ace Bruiser into the corner. Connor can't, can't keep him there. Can now. I can't get to anyone. Oh! Ooh, is Wolf no! Oh, oh, Cyborg, why have you changed your mind? I said it's Wolf me. decided to wake up Teddy. Had a chance to eliminate Demire there. Anarchy turning Cyborg around. He's gone. He's gone. Cyborg has gone. The big guys are falling quickly in this. Oh, I didn't know it's Ace Bruiser. Did you see Ace Bruiser leave uh, us? No, I actually don't remember that happening. You got rid of Ace Bruiser. Was it? Oh, no, I think I do. I think it was Connor that did it. He's going to get Demire here if I'm not careful. There we go. What is Aaron Wolf back onto the doing? Ropes. He's getting a run up. Oh, Demire's gone with the oh hands my God. of Connor. Let's take Aaron Wolf out. I'm sorry, Demire. I try my best. And Why now is he just having a little sit down in We corner? need Kevin Owens for that situation. <laughs> right no! Wolf escapes. Got Ted Alpha still in this one. Connor Cunningham. You've still got... Anarchy. It's Wolf will be annoyed that he second. wasn't the one to get rid of Demaya as he just exits on the bottom of the screen right yeah, there. Just seem to have a little issue with each other. Let's fly. Oh, God. Oh, he almost got him in position then. Oh, that's oh. a big miss by Anarchy. He gets stomped in the face. Whoa, Ted, what do you want? Get away. Everyone seems to be ganging up an Anarchy for some reason. Oh. What does Anarchy look like under all of that? Who knows? This full yeah, creature from Mars. Oh, he's going to take a run up. Oh, he's gone. Oh, my days. Oh, oh my oh, days. Goodbye. Throw. We're down to the final three. He's straight after Connor. No wasting time. I think Connor oh, might God. have the most to limit. He's gone. Oh, he's my gone God. He's gone. <gasps> How's he managed that? On? I think Connor might have the most eliminations. Possibly. If he got Ace Bruiser and he also got me as well. Oh, this is power. Is. God grief, are Ted Alpha and Anik are going to work together here? Nope! They are not. I'm going to take Ted down, I'm going to get rid of Connor, and then I'm going to come back for Alpha. <laughs> Game plans. Unless he reverses it. Aaron Wolf just <laughs> leaves now. Anik with Connor in the corner, and that's Connor, Connor gone. gone! Big boo! Just got Alpha to deal with. Alpha and Anarchy. Double A situation here. Ted Alpha's got a signature. Yeah, that doesn't bode well for me. Off the ropes. Nice, nice, nice! Oh, what that a is knee. brutal. Almost rolled all the way out of the ring there, Ted Alpha. 
Oh dear. Reverse is it. And now Ted Alpha. Oh. Reversing that. I can't let him get going. He's got a signature. If he gets that in, it's over. He's oh gonna, no, gonna, he's going to finish. Has he gone for a hit? Oh my god. No. Oh dear. I thought it's not going to be pleasant for Anarchy. Oh dear. What a combination here by Ted Alpha. Oh my, what is, I don't think I've ever seen this move before. A combination of moves. Ted Alpha's got no reversals, but he, have, he has got a finish. Oh, oh no, no, he's going to get him on the ropes. Standing keeps bomb bashing. Oh, oh reversal back. I'm still on the ropes. <laughs> Ted Alpha can't Ted. believe it. What is this stare off? What's happening? I don't like this. He's going to change his mind at any second, then I'm going builds. out of this ring. The tension builds. Oh my god! What? <laughs> he hesitated! <laughs> what was that from Ted Alpha? Not actually sure. Hesitation may have cost him the match. Did he see the Free Star Championship closing in so quickly? Did he see Kenny Omega's face pop up when Anakin mm. was just there in front of him? Visions. Has it ever happened? See you later! later. Oh my Anakin words. wins our fourth Battle Royale. I had some crazy moments. How many finishes had Ted Alpha receiving? I that? know. It's receiving another one there. And there. I the think Ted that's Alpha where he, he throws uh, Aaron Wolf out, doesn't he? Ted Alpha. Uh, the creator of Ted Alpha must be like, Oh my god, you Muppet. When he was just staring at Anarchy. Our oh, well ten cent. All they had to do was run close line. And I know. Gone. I was waiting for it, but I wasn't sure if he were going to do it or not. What was he thinking? So tense. I think the image of Kenny Omega popped up. Yeah. Before. <gasps> not again. Not after Wrestle Kingdom Nine or whatever it was. Anarchy then joins Carl Stevens, Pierre Michel, and Kevin Ion. Our fifth battle royale then, and we are starting off with Brandon Burton. And guess what? This is from Brandon Burton. Oh, wow. His nickname is The Superman. Signature 1 is called BLB. Signature 2 is called The B Zone. His first finisher is The Butterfly Lungblower. And his second is called The Super Power Bomb. Basically someone who I would want to be if I was a wrestler, Brandon says. The face paint is a symbol of respect for any and all competition. Brandon Burton. Next up we have got Ryan Garrick and this is from Ryan Monkey. His signatures are a spear and the other one is a butterfly lung blower. Oh, similar to Brandon. But this time it is called the Warhammer for Ryan. The finishes are the same. Arm trapped cross face which he calls the Long Island Stretch and the electric chair half Nelson suplex which is a mouthful called Fury Road. He also has a message for everyone competing in the contest. Last time I was here, I was unable to win, but I made an impact. I threw some weak, pathetic jabroni into a bunch of sweaty and greasy marks. And now that I'm back, I'm on a war path. And it ends with capturing the Freestar Championship. If I can't do that, then you won't see my face in Freestar Wrestling again. Following Ryan then, we have got... Wait for it. The Real Deal, Kyle Murphy. And this is from C Murdoch underscore... 32. Not too much we know about this guy. He definitely needs to have his left bicep checked up on. Yeah, what's happening there? I know, the, the other uh, one's fine. Maybe the arm thing's squeezing too tight. No description for Kyle Murphy. Just wanders in freestar. Hopefully his uh, actions will speak louder than his words then. Is he rocking Converse? It looks Is like it. Is he rocking Converse at freestar? It looks like it. Show some respect, the real deal, Kyle Murphy. The Luchador is here. I don't think he can believe it himself. This is from LDKRZ. The creator is that guy underscore 64. And it's basically just Deluchador for Freestar. Finishes are a snap German suplex and a crossface. I'm loving the unique headpiece. Yeah, that's good headgear, that. Definitely sets him apart from other masked wrestlers. But the real deal, Kyle Murphy, is not impressed one bit. Deluchador. Back at Freestar, it is Corbin Cash. This is from Mr. SeaWorld. He's got the same finishing names and the two attires, but there's one more thing to note about in this series. After failing to make an impact on his debut in Freestar last year, Corbin Cash disappeared for a while in order to ready himself 
for his next outing. This time around, he paid top dollar to fulfill a dream of his, as he got trained by his personal hero, The Miz. Oh dear. I don't know if that's going to help him, to be honest, for being like £2.60 an hour. I think Miz charges through the roof and he'll <laughs> teach him nothing. It's taught him all about the entrance and the style, nothing yeah. about wrestling in the ring. Holding cash out here then. Let's see who's next. Just when you thought we had a step up in ego with Corbin Cash, out steps Oberon from the Truth Sheet. The core's backstory is that he was formerly an actor from Broadway, though not exactly a great one. From multiple critics giving his works bad reviews, he was unable to find much work in theatre, so he decided to make the jump to pro wrestling as you do. Even though he claims that he's done with theatre, he still can't seem to let go of his former career doing such things as giving himself the name of Oberon from the play A Midsummer Night's Dream. Bowing after every match and thinking he is the centre of attention. His finisher names are the Fall From Grace, which is a fist drop, and the Exuant, which is a butterfly DDT. Ladies and gentlemen of Freestar, the spotlight is on him. Oberon is it, upon you. It seems like a smart jump for you to wrestling. It's yeah. kind of the same thing. <laughs> With a bit more physicality. Penultimately then, we have got from Hunter, the big guy YouTube, I'm guessing that stands for At Prodigy Among Us. It is Chase Matthews, aka The Prodigy Chase Matthews. He is cocky and arrogant, yet he always gets the job done through his ability to manipulate his opponents with his tactical, strong and aggressive fighting style. As you can see through his signatures being a combination of elbows and his finishes being a set of devastating knee strikes, he's always looking to get the knockout on his opponent. His finishes are named the final calling and the second one is the finishing touch. When the time comes for making a freestyle champion, you shouldn't have to look much further than the prodigy, Chase Matthews. Finally then, in Battle Royale number 5 from Atreyu. Dot B R Z. Sorry if I'm pronouncing that wrong. We have got Arik Nemeth. And his nickname is The Disaster. He's a giant from Germany with Nordic roots. Brackets. That's why he looks Viking ish. His moveset is all about inflicting damage to his opponents, or rather, victims who step foot in the ring with him. He's not in it to impress the fans, he just feels the urge to fight and found wrestling was a good way to take care of that. His first signature is a face crusher, his second signature is called the Bloody Gull. His first finisher is called the Gates of Valhalla. And his corner finisher, which is his second finisher obviously, is called the Runic Boot. This is Arik Nemeth. And I should say he's got two badass attires actually and we didn't really know which one to go with. Yeah, this one was uh, the second attire but it was set to default so oh, I went right. with this one. Look how big he is! That's the top rope there. Let's get Battle Royale number five underway. Okay, Oberon, bottom left for me. I am the Luchador! Uh, don't you How start, do you naturally Arik? be matched up with the biggest guy in the because ring? Because obviously the biggest guy in the ring has gone for his biggest threat. I think not the biggest is he... threat. Oh my god. Ah. Yeah, I just tried to save a car and crash, it wasn't to be. <laughs> barely lift one leg of Arik. Oh my word! Punched across the ring. Go! Oh! I didn't even intend to get him! The Luchador! Just when I survived it and get kicked in the back of the head by Corbin Cash. Look at Ryan. Oh, nice done, Brandon. Chase Matthews. Hell Murphy. Going at it there. Absolutely dropping these elbow strikes on him. <laughs> Brandon. This is Oberon. Boom, nicely done. Oh my god! Brandon, what are you doing? Chase! Chase! Perfectly god done. God damn it, oh, Brandon. Oh, look at the. Look at him, the face. just whacking each other, Brandon. Oh, what there happened then? Kyle taken down as well, the luchador going to the top rope. Really? On the middle rope there. Hey, what was... God, you rude man. <sighs> what's Kyle doing? Kyle's lost... Oh, I'm, I'm leaving Oh, him. what's Colin Cash doing there? Oh, God. Cheers, Matthews. Oh, oh. Just watching this Kyle, 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 Kyle. Kyle! Hands on. How has he managed that? Oh, we might look at <laughs> Did 
Jeez, look at the push. Oh my right god. In the face. He's still holding on. Arik is holding me then. Oh, where'd you come from? Oberon. He's playing it cool like that. <gasps> Whoa! Oh my word. Oh my god. Gone. Kyle Murphy hangs on in there. Eric Nemeth can't believe it. Oh no, Brandon, why did you do this? Cheers, Matthews. I'm going for you. No, I'm not. Ryan closing oh, in on Oberon. Oh, oh, Bad decision, oh. my friend. Ryan on the ropes. Mm, I'm not going to run at him. I'm not going to risk it. Oh, he's escaped. Yeah. Mm. Ah, da, 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 oh, and a punch. How's he stopped that? No, 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 no. No, 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 no. Look at his punches from Oberon. Ryan Garrett does not have a oh, clue oh, what's oh. just hit him. I can't watch, I've got to try and get out of this. We have survived. Oberon signature. Beautiful well, over fantastic. Kyle Murphy. Everyone's still here, that is a surprise and a half. Very good. Oh, Corbin Cash saw that. He did. I've gone up top too many times. Oh Christ. Spinning heel kick. Oh my God! I'm sorry Kyle Murphy. No you're not. Oh, he survived it! It glitched! Oh, it's not anymore. Oh, oh, God! I thought you'd fallen out of the ring. <laughs> I thought we'd both been eliminated. Corbin's coming straight I for you. I saw that. Oberon sees everything. Take that. God! Did you see Oberon? No, he nearly happened? broke. You did it to him. Oh, did it? He broke up a move. Oh, really? Now, Ryan? Ryan Garrett, that busted up. And I what's do not there? know. I do not know. Do you want to help me? Mm. That's a no, then. Great. Terrific. Oh, but I, I thought I did, but he might end. No, we totally missed Kyle Murphy exiting did, as well. I forgot he even went. When did that happen? Corbin, 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 cash! Ryan Gat. No! Hold on! Hold on! He's holding. Oh, God, oh, we're on in trouble there from Ryan Garrett. He's busted up and so I'm born to pick with Ryan. Alright, 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 Eric is in a very dangerous position there. <gasps> Suplex. Jesus. Corbin. Cash. <laughs> that failed. Set it up that failed. Failed. Locked it. Brandon Burton still in. Ryan Garrick. Chase Matthews. Eric Nemeth. No, Eric. No, Eric. Don't do this. Oh my god, have you stopped oh, him? I reversed him, but he's just staring at him like we saw in the last Battle Royale. Look at Eric Nemeth, he can't believe the strength of Oberon. Oh my god, I think you've totally been saved. More people need to get eliminated, what's happening? Hanging around for weeks. <laughs> are, you, are you really going to try that? Can't now you. I will. Yes! God damn it, you let Chase take me out. Look at him. Oh. Brandon. Brandon. Oh, I think he's oh, gone. I think he's gone. Ryan Garrett in style. Good grief. I'll, I'll avenge you, Brandon. I'll avenge you. God, Brandon. I'll avenge you. Look at his face. What a mess. Brandon Burton leaves Oh, that was us. convenient. Here we go, Brandon. This is for you. Stamina, please. Stamina, he's please. He's waiting for it. He's like, Stamina, please. please. Then, come on. Stamina, please. Screw you. You should have it now, surely. It didn't seem to want to work. As if you're still up there. <laughs> oh God, Corbin's going to take his seat. No, no, you're not. <laughs> no, you're not. Oh. Eric saw us. No, he's. Oh God. Do no, I don't go for me. Don't it's go for me. It's a battle royale, Ryan. What have you done? <laughs> I'm still trying to avenge him. He's got dark red head damage. How does that even happen? In the battle royale. What has happened here? Right. Now we're going to avenge him. It just bounced back. What's happening I here? Know. Why are you doing this to me, man? Whoa, Eric! Whoa, Eric! Oh, no. No, Ryan. No, not an Oberon. No, not an Oberon. No. Oh, my God. Can you hold out? Can you hold out? Super fast. Oh, my video. God. You might have this. You might have this. You might have this. I can't watch. Yes. Oh no! Oh, Brad survives, oh, but no. the Luchador doesn't. The Luchador is gone. Aaron's <gasps> going to Corbin Cash. Oh my God! The cat, Ryan. It, honestly, leave, leave. I've been trying to get him out for the past ten minutes. He doesn't even want to. You've got dark red head damage, Ryan. He can't take it. Oh, super kick. Chase is wanting desperately to get Ryan. The Luchador's just waiting for Eric to leave before he leaves. <laughs> God. <laughs> 
cast to eliminate. Oh my they God. cast the man to eliminate Arik Nemo. Oh, what the man. hell? You can't get eliminated after levitating. <laughs> Chase Matthews, another one. No. What's happening with the glitch here? I have no idea. Finish. Oh no. It's oh, you've got him this time. Corbin Cash has booted her. Oh. No. <laughs> Cash there. What's Cash on a signature and a finisher? Ryan Garrett, red, dark red, I should say, head damage. Oh god. What has he even happened in a battle royale? Beautiful. Chase Matthews being on. Why do you keep doing that? You're an actor, not a magician. <laughs> he has oh. two finishers now. What was Lazy. That? Oh, clap around the ears. Slipped around the back. To the knee, one punch into the corner! Oh! And how have you done that? Another for Oberon! Look at Ryan though! This guy's a madman! He's gonna be on the ropes, is he? One punch! He's gonna oh. finish! You're doomed! You are doomed! You've got no reversals! <laughs> finish. You have no reversals and he has a finish! The madman He's Ryan got a and a finish. You've got one back now. Make it count if you want to win this match. <gasps> Signature for Oberon! Ryan Garrett, your time has come! Oh my god! Carbon Calf is now leaving the ring. Don't be taunting! Unless you're gonna do some it's levitation his again. Stage. It's his stage, it's his time. No, it's not. I ain't going to reverse this. <laughs> Swinging net breaker by Ryan Garrett with that dark red head damage. Oh god. Is he gone for is he his finisher? Oh, He's gone for his dear. finisher! If he goes forward, he's hitting the ropes. Oh! Oh my god! Oh, god. That oh, is god. too fancy! <laughs> Good Where grief! Go? I don't know! Through the ring? Maybe he is a magician after all. Oberon. He is out of it, look at him. He's not out of it. Lifeless. Ryan Garrett's out of it. <gasps> oh, but I've got a finish! You have? Why have I got a finish? I, you've had it for quite a while. Oh jeez. Oh jeez. It's Oba's end. Oh god. The chance he could take though, Ryan Garrett is giving Oba on a chance to get reversal back and he's, he's knacking now, Ryan he's Garrett. He's building up towards another finish. He's sat on a He's not taking the opportunity to get rid. Oh god. Of the actor. He is an actor. Oh my god. What now is your it's his signature! Him. He could get the job done, put him out of his he misery. He might be now, this might be it, he might go for it. Put him out of his misery, Ryan. Oh, oh on the head, on the head! Reversal. Oh. oh no! Don't do this! Why are you bowing? He's gone. Oh <laughs> my god! <laughs> oh my word! <laughs> what a finishing touch by Oberon. I thought he had scooped it all up then. Clap though for uh, Ryan Garrett. My word. Oh. I mean, what happened to him? It's the most the story told to him. The we've seen. So far, the Bar Royale. What is that? He just went out to her. Oh, Bronny wasn't even bothered about winning see the match. his face then when he was upside down? Oh my he god. He brought the pain to everyone in freestyle, but in the end. Oh god. Brandon, look behind you. Oh dear. <clears throat> it is Oberon. How's he managed to cheese that? He joins Anneke, Kevin Iron, Pierre Michel, and Carl Stevens. Unbelievable performance. Unbelievable elimination. Battle Royale number six then, and starting us off is DJK from At Blade. DJK. The core name is DJK, and he's like last time, but he's a bit more arrogant this time around after his free star Moaj fame. And he's also more aggressive. He already made arrangements for that freestyle championship being in his trophy cabinet. Oh, that's risky. That's the mark of death. You never do yeah. that, Blade. It's like wearing winning pants. <gasps> He's also wearing winning <laughs> pants. <laughs> to be fair, that's on us. We did change to a second attire. <laughs> the DJK starting off battle round number six. Who's up next? Second up, prepare to have nightmares because from Chazzy. We have got Big Boy Steve. He's called this because it was dropped on his head when he was a baby. 
His brain fell out of his left nostril and his head grew to an abnormal size. His finisher is off the top rope and is called Brain Dead. His inspiration is Kurt Hawkins. <laughs> Why? I don't know what this is. I don't know what that description was. Chazzy, what have you created here? I think he's got tire treads over his head. <laughs> and just eyes stuck on the back of his jacket as well. I don't know what's going on here. So just uh, have a nice little conversation with him, DJK, whilst we wait for our third opponent. <laughs> Up next, this is the first call from Sleepy. As he has actually brought two calls to this competition after getting two t-shirts. The first one is called Derek Murphy, as you see on screen now. Murphy is a Ring of Honor star that came to Freestar just for the tournament. I like the unique look. Definitely got something different about him. Not the same as everybody else. Yeah, the ears. Hold on about the ears, it's just the whole look in general. That's where there were a sign which said where the big boys are at. Mm. Were Freestar about the Ring of Honor, what? Well, no, I'm thinking were they expecting Big Boy Steve? Oh, okay. And second from Sleepy is Damien Knight. And he is a competitor that was an ex English military vet who decided one day to be a wrestler. Alright, just like that. So both from Sleep we have got Derek Murphy and Damien Knight. From TJ Holwick then we have got TJ. Some brief information about him. He is charismatic but he knows when to be ruthless. With his multitude of bat breakers and leg moves. He has a submission in case he has the darkness inside him, whatever that means. That's weird. But only when the match is going to be a war. He has two attires, one of which is normal when the match seemed to be a normal fight and the other is when he wants to go to war. Which is also when we said the submission will enter. Question is, this is his first attire isn't it? It is. Does he believe this is just a piece of cake basically? Maybe. So TJ is here. From Harry So Epic we have got H.R. Xavier. His nickname is the Dark Red Warrior. Right now, he's a heel, but he can be a face if you want. His signatures are Shades of Parish, which is a super kick, and he's also got a Spine Buster. His finisher is the Xaviator, which is a Snapmare Driver, and you've also got the Knee of Xavier, which is a Jumping Knee Strike. His hometown is Suffolk, England. And there we go, HR Xavier. Second to last from Adrian Roddy. We've got Jacob Haley. And I've got no description for Jacob Haley. Okay. I like his attire. I'm digging the carbon fibre look. Yeah, I like the neon at the start. Very robotic. Liking the hair as well. I wonder if he's got a clothesline to match that uh, almost arm gauntlet he's <laughs> yeah, on the possibly. right. Yeah, His armoured gauntlet. This is Jacob Haley. Welcome to Freestyle. And lastly, from Jacob Crow, we have got A.K. Kara way. Very nice. The back of his trunk says a genocide. <clears throat> I'm hoping that doesn't take place tonight. No information. Similar to Jacob Haley, I've just got AK Caraway. Obviously he doesn't want many people to know what he's up to and what he's about. You probably don't want to get close to him even look at him. He'll let his actions do the talking for him, no doubt, as we get into this battle royale. Okay, AK Caraway for me. I am Jacob Haley in the middle. What a punch to HR Xavier. He doesn't even know what's hit him. You're fighting my dread brother. Your dread brother. Dread brother! You're fighting your evil doppelganger. Yep. And Big Boy Steve is fighting his evil doppelganger. <laughs> oh, Derek Murphy spun into Steve there. Oh, night. Oh, God. Working on Jacob. No! Right, big oh, man. Ooh! Okay. That have been brutal. Working with TJ. Hmm. Whoa, 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 whoa. I will destroy you, Damien. What okay, maybe. has happened to DJK? Whoa! Why has he got so little that much? And he's busted open now. TJ has help gone him wild. This is, this I'd help him, because, I mean, he's just been bullied. I have to stop a case of bullying here at Freestar. <laughs> Unbelievable. 
been an he's embarrassing on performance him. so far. He's still on him. He can't get, if he gets eliminated, this is the worst performance we've ever seen at freestyle in a battle royale. Right, I'm going to help him which out. Which is a claim to fame in itself. I'm going to help him out, because, I mean, this is just cruel from him. Oh, my God. Big boy stick. No, DJK. Be careful, DJK. You're on the edge of being eliminated here. Oh, right to the knee. He's not got a dance partner. Hey, big boy Steve. Hmm. He's actually getting moves in here. The absolute maniac that he is. Guess I'll go back for TJ. Which has over in the corner as Damien Knight got finished. He has. Wow. Oh my DJ God. Xavier left us before DJK. Really? What happened? I missed it. He just got taken out by Damien Knight with a finisher in the corner. Oh, wow. Oh, oh. No you push over Damien DJ Knight. There. Or Derek Murphy did. Oh, I'm blocked. Oh, cold cool breaker. I am gone. Jacob Haley is oh, crap. gone. I thought you were going to win it. He charged at me. And there was no reversals there. Derek Murphy on the top. So who have we got left? DJK, AK Caraway. Damien oh, Knight. Man. Oh! DJ. Big Perfect. Boy. How is oh, he's gone. There were too much there for DJK. How is Big Boy Steve still in the match, but we've lost? Because look at his positioning. Whoa! Oh my days! Damn, that was terrific! Oh Whoa. my god! What's happening? Again? What is happening right now? Way too quick. It's a nice move being shown here by David Knight. Big Boy's going all the way. Just say AK Caraway. I think he's only 84 overall. Oh wow! Oh my days! Well, we have got a few who are in the mid 90s in this think match. We're getting out of this. I don't think you're getting out Have of this. Have a bit of faith. Okay, you're getting out Have of this. Have a bit of faith. Who's on the floor there? Is I am not leaving before Big Boy Steve. <laughs> <laughs> It'll come down to Big Boy Steve and uh, you. AK. Oh this my word. Unbelievable. Oh he's my word. He's taking TJ out. No, he hasn't. Oh no, he's not. I thought he was going for his finish. Okay. <gasps> oh my god. He almost took TJ out. I, just, I missed what happened. Derek Murphy's just been wiped out by Damien Knight. The two creators going at it. The oh, same yeah, guy. Of course. The same person created Damien. these two. Blood Brothers. Oh my god, Big Boy Steve. A couple of chops to TJ. Oh, oh TJ works TJ's back. gonna take Big Boy out. Oh no! Around oh, the glasses. AK's getting up. Oh god, does he wear the glasses? Oh my god, he does. Derek. Signature here. I don't know who I'm gonna use it on Big Boy Steve. Oh my word. I just threatened him. <laughs> Signature. Steve! Oh god. Oh Steve. my god. Well, his origin story is something similar to that. What's TJ doing? Just lurking. Oh my days. I'm Steve. not even gonna wait. Oh, oh TJ! What's this little alliance with him on Big Boy Steve? Was it his mentor? <laughs> oh god. He's coming for you! He is! Oh my days! Good lord. What's that Stop to yet? the face is what TJ's trying TJ's to take out everyone. Derek. Derek. And now he's going after Damien. Oh Total my wipe out. You can't take him in that corner! He was trying to get a double elimination. Something unprecedented. Who did you guys in this match? Jacob. I was Jacob Haley. How did he go so gone. quickly? What was all that? Hey, Derek Murphy. Don't try. Oh my God, he's got. Us. <laughs> oh, that were nice. I reckon rather to a face splat. Damien's on two finishes now. Big Boy Steve's on one. Derek's on one. I can't see what AK and TJ are on. I think I've got finish. Damien. Damien's oh, leavers. Oh, the Derek, 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 Derek. Not by Big Boy. St wow. Damien Knight's going to be coming for Big Boy Steve. Did Big? He's in the final four. Big Boy Steve's winning this match. Big boy Steve's winning this match. I foresee it. I foresee oh, nice done by TJ there. I thought you were going to slip over and fall. Net break. Derek Murphy can't believe it. He can't. AK, Caraway, to Big Boy Steve! Underestimated Big Boy. TJ. TJ's taking it out! Oh my word. How is Big These boy two are going to work Steve? together on AK Caraway now, aren't they? How is Steve surviving? I actually secretly think it's just a mask and he's a really good wrestler. Oh. It's just, uh. It's a disguise. How did he not use his finish there on TJ? He's got two. Damien Knight, it's over. You've got to leave, mate. Oh, man. He shouldn't have been, but it is. It is. The rules are rules. I thought he had a good chance in this day. Did Knight you see Steve's started. reaction to that? I'd just get away if I were to like to fight. He's going to be big boy. Steve's going to win this. <laughs> TJ. 
is gone by AK Carraway. How is he in the final two? There's only going to be a final one, though. And he that's says on the AK. back of his jacket, Come on. I suck. On the back of his jacket. Come on. Come on. Come on. He looks at you every time you do it. And he's like, nah, a few more minutes, man. <laughs> right, I'm going to initiate this myself. <gasps> God damn it. slapped him down. This is crazy that he's come to this. I thought Big Boy Steve came in as the comedy punches. character, like a Santino Morella. Oh jeez, you almost- Oh, I ended up there! Oh, oh my god! god. <laughs> jeez, that is... went in slow motion <laughs> It was one clothesline away from winning that battle royale. That went in slow motion. This- <laughs> Oh my god. AK Caraway. Did you see the red eyes? Why is the referee going here? His eyes went mad! AK oh. Caraway wins the sixth battle royale. Only just there was almost the biggest upset yet. But Big Boy Steve eventually got eliminated. Seventh battle royale then. Now at this point we've got nine superstars left. So what we've decided to do, we've decided to do a six man battle royale here for our seventh battle royale. And the final battle royale will be a four man battle royale. And we'll have to put in a random superstar there just to make it up to that four. So the six man battle royale, the second to last one. We are starting off with Oli Heno. And this is Crimson. I've got no description. We just know he's called Crimson. Okay, very mysterious. Was that after his tattoo, maybe? I wonder if the design on his face is a tattoo or face paint. Hopefully it's face paint, because face tattoos are scary. And he's got Immortal on the back of his jacket. We'll see about that. From, wow, this is unbelievable. From Dylan Shah, we have got Doctor. I've got no more description on it. I, I don't know what's happening here. This is the weirdest entrance we've seen. It's the weirdest combination of attire I've ever seen. Just jeans and a shirt and some chainmail and looks like one of their medical masks. Don't forget the tie as well. Oh, the tie, yeah, I didn't even notice that. They're going words. around for another spin. But Behold the greatness. The people who are watching this haven't even seen the face paint under that yet. I get the attire. He's a doctor. I get it. It makes sense. That clicked. Took too long. I'm sorry, what? He's a doctor, so he has to wear the face mask and he wears a nice uh, nice dress clothes. Oh, yeah. Yeah, do you get oh, it that's now? Clicked. Do you get it now? Yeah. yeah. The screens of doctor. I don't know about the head thing. I don't know what that's about. And the tiger face paint. And the tiger face paint. <laughs> Imagine <laughs> going to doctors and this guy walks in. <laughs> Following doctor then from David Allen Pudge, we have got Hailstorm. He's again back at it to continue where he left off from the Moaj Village t-shirt campaign. He has since left Sovereign and returned to his violent patriotic ways and is hell bent on making a name for himself in Freestar. He's also in it to make men fear his name. He has worked on becoming faster and stronger to ensure he reaches his goal. This is Hailstorm. Next up! is Psycho Cody and this is from Cookie Monster 55 he grew up on the bad side of town and going to brawls as a teenager and now brings his experience to dominate Freestar this is Psycho Cody he's coming in to dominate straight away not sure he's going to manage that I don't know it's, uh, it's entirely possible from what we've seen Doctor's going to be absolutely mental <laughs> Hailstorm could be a tough challenge for him. And as for Crimson, I'm not sure yet. I'm not convinced. I'm not convinced. It's Although he has got Immortal on the back of his jacket. Yeah, Let's not forget that. Had to get a read on him. So Psycho Code is out here. From Liam Brennan, we have got LDB. And he's a worldwide wrestler. And he's finally on his way to a championship. And he's going to make the best of it. LDB is from Parts Unknown. His signature move is a super kick to the back of the head, which he calls Infinite Concussion. 
The other is the Anaconda Vice, which he calls Ugliest Way to Sleep. Finisher moves are the Punk Kick, which he calls Bringing to a Halt. And the last finishing move is a Shooting Star Springboard Splash, which he calls the High Air Fast Splash. A Shooting Star Springboard Splash. That's the one. That sounds amazing. Which he calls the High Air Fast Splash. This is LDB. From Zeno Agrius, we have Atlas. Oh my oh, word. The doctor will be staring at him. He'll though. be furious. Look at that! Get ready for this. This is quite the description. Oh dear. <coughs> now I know what you are thinking. Anyone else noticing the statue of godliness moving? Fear not, for it's only the glorious warrior known as Atlas, a name self given through his heavy weightlifting regime and fantastic physique. He was once a regionally popular Caligula footballer before his cocky persona gained him the ear of the other superstars and eventually caused for his departure. It was then that he turned his stride to wrestling. There his showmanship would not be expected but praised. Here in freestyle wrestling he has the chance to prove that he is more deserving of the admiration of all that he comes across. Though with his relative inexperience and lacklustre ability in the technical department, the pressure is on as Atlas truly has the weight of the world on his shoulders. At last, Atlas, prepare to fall from grace. Finishes is the fall from grace, which is a backside driver. He then got Grand Sacrifice as well for his second finisher. And he's also got a couple of signatures, which he calls the True Grace and True Power. This is Atlas. What a character. I'm loving him already. Let's get into this battle royale. Okay, hailstone for me. I am oh, Atlas, and I'm taking on the greasiest guy in the world. Just taking out LBB in style. Does he fly? Does he oh fly? no! Slipping behind. Does he fly? Oh, oh he does. leg drops. He leg drops. He misses. What a kick! Oh my god, he just crumbled. <laughs> oh my god! Stay away from, from you. <laughs> kicking wizard. Yeah, he kicking wizard. <sighs> Fucking me now! <laughs> what is that Doctor character? Unlike anything we've ever seen. It's like um, King from Tekken. Yeah. Um, LDB. <laughs> what has happened to it? He's got no reverses. Why are you just stomping in the. Oh, there you go. He's out. He's not <laughs> turned around though and realised that Hailstorm's got a signature. <sighs> just keeps punching him in the back. A Hailstorm <laughs> has gone out. Oh god. That's LDB taken care of. Atlas. Where are you here? Mm. Finish. This is your finish. Jeez. Jeez. At least you're in a safe place. Yeah, yeah, that's true. That's true. Grounded. Oh, they be not selling my moves. Oh my god. Anyone tries to eliminate Doctor, they're just going to slip out of his grasp. <laughs> Genius. Psycho Cody working on Doctor. That's probably a good partnership. <laughs> Crimson. Oh god, what's he doing? Oh! He's up trying to eliminate him. Look how tall Hailstorm actually is. I think I remember it from last series we were surprised that he's high. I think he's like 6'10 or something. What the hell was that, Doctor? Right. Crimson. Ah, he's getting out. He's getting out. Yeah. Crimson save! Oh, oh he's dropped him on his head. What was that? What? What? Well, that's Psycho Cody for you. I think. Yep, true. Yep. Living up to the gimmick. Hailstorm going at it here. Oh! Nice combination and a knee! LDB. That's Coming pretty at nice me. from Crimson. How's Atlas doing? Oh. Signature time! Oh yeah! Flying up. Look at him in the middle of the ring. Victorious. You might be taken out here. Jesus! Oh, no. Wow. That is some strength there from Crimson. Oh, oh god! Atlas! I didn't see a Crimson coming yeah, over there. turn your back in a battle royale. I didn't see him coming! <laughs> oh, Doctor's trying to take everyone out. He might get LDB. No! Oh. Psycho Cody might get him. Oh, he's backing it up. He's back. Oh, backing up what? <laughs> backing up what? Didn't see that coming. <laughs> he ran into it as well. Doctor's like, what? I thought you were supposed to hit me. What's happened? <laughs> Wasteland. Oh, and the scent on. Very nice. Doctor might get LDB out. Oh again. my god! Freedom! 
<laughs> he did say he's not technically the best. He did, he did. He found eliminated Psycho <laughs> Cody <laughs> somehow. Stuck in corner. Oh god, he's stuck in corner. <laughs> What's happening to him? Finisher. He just punched him in a little tornado pattern. He looks so small. This is the same tactic we saw from Ryan Garrett, which is a. Uh, forget about the eliminations. It almost got the job done for him. It did. Bloody hell, oh! Doctor! What happened? I went running at him! Oh my god! No! <laughs> I've just dominated hey, the match! Hey, of... Oh! LDB Super... No. Oh my god, he's holding up! Oh, oh no. my god! Oh my god, he reversed it! I can't reverse was that? That was amazing! Wait, no. did he take the kick and then he... Yeah, how have I been the first eliminated out of everyone? And I'm, look at everyone's health. I've done that to everyone. But I can't believe it, Hailstorm. We were dominating. It was too easy for us. Oh my god. No. Now have you gone? Oh. Hailstorm. Look at who's left. How's Hailstorm gone before these? LDB is now gone. Unbelievable. I don't know, my god, then. It might have been mad if I'd have gone for it. Come on, Doctor. Oh no. Ooh, straight there for the elimination. I've got to concentrate. I've got to concentrate. LDB, it's over. It is. It's over, LDB. Atlas took you out, the god himself. With the weight of the world on his shoulders. Oh, nice face wash there to the doctor. Is it face paint or is it a tattoo? It's <laughs> always the question. Jesus, you don't have that tattoo. Um, I won't really be questioning it, really. That'd be mad. Yeah, I think he might be gone here. I think he might be gone. He's got the run up. <gasps> he hangs on. I don't know how, but he hangs on. Oh, oh my God. Psycho Cody turning around. Atlas is there with a finish. He has Psycho gone. Psycho's gone. He tried to get Do Doctor White. Dun, 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 the dun. number one rule. Don't turn your back on the superstars in this. On the It's yours, Crimson. Do you want him? No, apparently not. Is that Crimson's mask? I don't know what he's going for with that half face structure, whatever he's got on him. Oh, oh wow! Oh my god! Whoa! Oh my god! Oh my days. Crimson and Atlas now. No! Oh, slipping behind. Atlas still holds on to his finish, but Crimson, same, well, worse body damage actually, but Atlas is going to join him pretty soon. <laughs> Real disrespectful. You respect the man to wear a jacket like that when he's in the ring. You sucker. Why do you keep reversing me? Again. Come on, Crimson. Looking for the upset on Atlas. How dare you, Crimson? How he's dare you? He's had it too you? easy in this match, Atlas. I never got my hands on him with Hailstorm properly. Come on, Crimson. He, look how good he thinks he is. <laughs> Come on, Crimson. Behold the god. Right, he's not reversed it this he time. Reverses this, it's hilarious. No, oh, he's got him. He's got him. Crimson eliminated, and we're left with Atlas, the god himself. Uh, seventh battle royale winner. Can't believe I can't believe Hailstorm were the first to go in that. That was dominated crazy. Everyone. What a I shock! Got, I had finishes galore. We're just using them, just like I'll, I'll get them later on. Look at me. We're amazing. He wasn't focused on the prize. And he again, just wanted destruction. It's Hailstorm's highlights. And then he's gone at this point. But we are. That's the last highlight. And it's Atlas who wins the battle royale. So if I'm not mistaken, there's only one more to go. There is. Final battle royale then. As we start with Joe. Kerr from Jackson Cunningham. I wonder whose inspiration this design is. Penguin. <laughs> so Jackson Cunningham giving us Joker. I've got no other information. Very mysterious. Much like the Joker is. No origin story. From Junishi Speaks, we have got the core, which is simply known as Ghost. Hailing from Japan, Ghost is nicknamed the Nipper Nightmare and excels in technical mastery and savagery alike. Crazed and psychotic, Ghost shows no mercy to his opponents and mixes high-flying offense with sheer brute force. His primary finisher is the Skull Scraper, which is a straight jacket brain buster. 
and his secondary is a Reaper's Sith, which is a corkscrew moonsault. He's sort of breaking down and he's been getting in the crowd's face all the way down to the ring. <laughs> he's breaking down. He did call him crazed and psychotic. Yeah. This is ghost. And lastly, the final call for this because we are in the fatal four-way battle royale and the final competitor will be a regular superstar. And in it all is Jeremy Becker with his core, Jeremy Mad Dog Becker. The story is simple. I went on a business trip to Japan. He might have seen ghosts there. I was stupid and spent more money than I had. And let's say I owed the wrong kind of people. They left me the choice to join them or to get beat up to the point where it would be unrecognisable. So I joined them and they had a plan to strengthen their influence in the United States. To achieve what goal they needed, someone popular so they made me a star in the wrestling world. I'm talking about the Yakuza, of course. This is Jeremy Becker. Mad Dog Becker, I should say. Yeah, I can see the Yakuza vibes. And lastly, just to make up the numbers so we've got a nice fatal four-way, making his debut on Freestar, Roderick Strong. He looks happy enough to be here. It's like, who have you put me in with here tonight? I don't know, I get the vibe that he's used to that sort of thing. The only regular superstar backstage, he must have seen some I love how he had no nonsense in his entrance, so he just walked out. <laughs> Not even bothered, just get out there and win the match. Let's see then who the final person's going to be to go forward into the Free Star Championship Tournament. Okay, I think we get rid of Strong because technically he's in this core competition. Okay, come and help me. He's then. all in there. Come and help me, come and help me. I'm trying. Not come and help me. Joker's. <sighs> I nearly got rid of Joker there. Joker's trying to help Roderick Strong here. New tag team. No, I'm joking. Oh, my, I might be gone here. Oh, thankfully you're blocking it. I'm hitting everyone. Now. I'm hitting everyone except Roderick Strong. Is it for me? Good catch there by Joker. I am. What a dog in this ghost. Camera for said. Need to get rid of Strong. He's technically not even meant to be in this match. No, we put him in as a formality. And he's gonna bloody win the thing. If we could do a triple threat battle royale, it'd have been fine. But we have to go for fatal four way. Right, come on, please go, Roderick. Right. Please. Are you gonna help me now? Are you gonna yeah. help me? Let's double push it. He's escaped. He's escaped. I'm pressing X. All oh, right. He's escaped, yeah. Get him, get him, get him, get him, get him. Hang on, hang on, wait for it. Go on, you got... Oh, okay. Still not wiped out. We should have done a double team. You're going to need your accuser guys on him. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Can we have a hit him, him please? Roderick's like, me? What, what have I done? Well, that English? I don't know what that... Can you hear me, please? <laughs> Did I say, can you hear me, please? <laughs> yeah, I don't I know said, what I you said. said hit. All right, okay. I said, can we put a hit on unclear, him, please? Unclear directions from the accuser leader. Is he the leader? I've made that up. I yeah. thought he was employed by... Yeah, he's there like, we go! He's, he's scared by him. Yeah, 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 yeah. They made threats to him, that's why he is. We did it. Maybe he will be a leader if he wins the Free Star Championship. Mad Dog took out the real signed superstar. Oh! Whoa! God, how many spins are we getting in this? Well, he's just spun his way into this. Um, no. Why? Joker has a bad do. Ooh, be careful. Oh, he's got the jab on another kick. Oh my god. Is Joker going to up against the ropes? He doesn't want to be. He's not. He's very close. I don't know what that is, but. Why did oh, I go? <laughs> <laughs> he's the best. Who's going to get the final slot in this core competition heading towards that three-star championship next round? Boom! Saw it coming a mile off. Finish. Oh, Him. God. What the hell is this? What the he You dead. Maybe. Joker, finish him. No, please don't. Apparently I'm Take me. him out, Joker. He's done for. He's gone. Oh, he slipped behind. He did. Sneaky, sneaky. Ooh, Jeremy Mad oh Dog God, hasn't God. seen ghosts behind him. Ah! Punch. No! Punch. No! Punch. No! <laughs> so silly. Oh, oh my God. God! What just <laughs> happened? I just saw the opportunity. I saw the moment of. <gasps> Why did he just go on the ropes for imperfect? It's like they just planned it backstage, right? What you, just I'll happened? get rid of him. You get on the ropes and it'll look smooth. 
Oh my god. Did George he climb up just, on him? I don't know. He must have done. He just set himself up perfectly for an ending. To be fair, he did kill him in that move. Wow, we didn't even see Jeremy's ending. They both got eliminated in the space of a second. Well, when Jeremy returns to the accuser. He's dead. Jesus. He's dead. Dark. They're not going to hire losers, are they? Like that. Dark. He's dead. Dark. Ghost wins the final battle royale. So when we're next on Freestar, as the tournament gets underway in the uh, 101 slash triple threat knockout stage, we have got Carl Stevens, Pierre, Michel, Kevin Iron, Anarchy, Oberon, AK, Caraway, Atlas, and lastly, as we have just seen, Ghost. Thank you to everyone who purchased the t-shirt. Hopefully you've all enjoyed watching this video and seeing your calls taking part. And we'll see you in the next round of the Freestyle Championship Tournament.